yeah, it's finally done. And the noise you hear in the background is our welder, because my dad's welding outside. And we got about the thickness of this steel of snow outside, <laughs> literally. But uh, otherwise, I'm done. Got the stack on. So let me just go through it here with my homemade air filter from Crappy Tire. It's got everything there. Okay, so I just had started it up to see the sound and it got all loose from there and here. This one was tight, but this, from there to here, it was all loose because the engine warmed up. So I tightened it up. I let it run for a little bit, let it warmed up. And uh, after I tightened the, uh, the pipe itself as tight as I can, and then I put the lock nut, and now it doesn't move. And I put the out. So right now this is a five inch, fits perfect. Goes down to a 90, and goes up to this four inch. And I bought this uh, reducer quite a while back, and um, I bought the reducer and I just cut the, uh, it was from a one inch, from a one inch pipe to a half inch. Have it here. This is the other piece that came off. Piece of shit. It was pretty hard to cut because it was pretty thick. And uh, just got that. Got a plate. Got a plate. I uh, put the plate welded to the reducer thing. And I did an amazing weld job. There's just that hole and the lip here and a bit down here where it's um I mean that's there where it's not welded but it's pretty good it's got a nice sound and got my baffle in there you can't see it so it's done for now I still got a mental carb leak coming from there and I'm pretty sure it's the needle because this thing is old. <laughs> and uh, I also found out that someone brazed the intake up there. But uh, that's okay. This bracket here was for the old exhaust. Jets and carb and all that good stuff. PCVs there. So, whatever. So here's the finished thing. From there. Pull. And then, eventually, eventually I am gonna cut a piece of this, or there's a scrap piece in this pile. Here it is. Grab this thing, stab it up there somehow, and put this Walsh plug from a carb, and it's just gonna flap, but it fits. It, this outer diameter of this plug is the outer diameter of this uh, pipe, so I make a flapper and it'll be cool. <laughs> but for now, I like the sound of it, it's awesome. So, all I gotta do now is just weld down here, all around, grind it down. Doesn't look pretty, but it's functional and it works great and it's awesome. So, Still gotta find some uh, 20 inch, 27 inch tires. And that's pretty much it. So, later. <laughs>